Hi everyone. Um, so I've had a lot of people ask me how to print off your Facebook friend list. And so I thought I would just make a video about it, make it easier. Now everyone can do it. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to screen share and I'm going to take you through exactly how to do it and then what it's going to look like when you print it off and then what I do with it once it is printed off. Um, okay. So let me see. Have to share screen. share screen. Okay, so let's see if we can get that out of the way. Okay. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to go to your own Facebook page and you're going to see on the right hand side is this little lock picture. You're going to click on that and then you're going to go down to see more settings. And you're going to click on that. And then on the left hand side, it says general. And once you click on that, you'll see down here it says download a copy of your Facebook data. So you're going to click on that. And then you're going to click this button here that says start my archive. Now, once you click that button here, it's going to ask you to put your Facebook password in and you're just gonna hit submit. And then I'm gonna go into my email, I'm gonna show you what Facebook is going to send you. So this is what you'll get, you'll get this email like right away, pretty much. And it's just saying, hey, we recently saw you request a copy of your Facebook data. Um, we'll send you another email with a link to your download when it's ready. So it's just telling you, hey, I'm working on it and we'll send it to you. Um, so that's the first email that you'll get. Then keep looking because you will get a second, oop, wrong one. Let's go back. Okay, so then you'll get a second email. Okay, that says that it's actually ready. Um, it's now ready for you to download. So it'll be down here and you'll click on that. Now, here's the thing. You, once you get this email, they give you a limited amount of time to use it. So I made the mistake the first time I did this is I got this email and I said, okay, I'll print it off at work in two days. And by the time I did that, it was gone. So you might have to redo it. Um, so just make sure that you're requesting a copy of your Facebook data right before you're going to be able to print it off. So once you get that, you'll see, um, and this is the only part that I can't show you because this is old, but you'll see it'll have um, something on the left-hand side that says friends. Make sure you click on that, and then all your Facebook friends will come up. So let me see if I can get off the screen share. Okay, so what you'll get is your Facebook friend list, if you can see that right here, and it just has a name, and they're not in alphabetical order, unfortunately, but you'll have a name and just a little bit of space in between each name. And then what I'm doing is I'm going through and I'm taking that name and I'm writing down where I am in the process of talking to them. So like this girl, she's interested in a five day. Um, and I'm seeing that I have some holes in my conversations with people. So like this second person I haven't talked to at all and the third person I haven't talked to at all. And then um, this fourth person is a coach of mine. So that's the only time that they come off my list. They're a coach, so I'm done. That's, you know, that's the end of the road. Um, so I basically go through and I'm just making notes under everyone, but it's really eye-opening because you can see who slipped through the cracks and who of your Facebook friends have you not talked to. And you can see this is pretty thick. I've got a lot of names on here. So you know, we should always be adding about three to five people to our network per day, if at all possible. So my plan is to be printing this off pretty much on a monthly basis since I'm going to see those new names that I've added. Um, so I hope this helped. And if you have any questions, just let me know and I'd be happy to answer them. Thanks, guys. Bye.